Callisto is Jupiter's second largest moon and the third largest moon in our solar system. With a size that is almost the same as Mercury, it was discovered January 7, 1610, by Italian scientist Galileo Galilei, along with Jupiter's three other largest moons, Ganymede, Europa, and Io. From being referred to as a boring ugly duckling moon to getting itself added to the list of worlds that could possibly harbor life, Callisto has been one of the most interesting space findings. If you take a keen interest in celestial bodies just like we do, you must watch this entire video where we discuss some amazing facts about Callisto. Number 1. The four largest moons of Jupiter, including Callisto are known as the Galilean moons after Galileo, who discovered them in 1610. They weren't discovered prior to this because they cannot be seen with the naked eye and Galileo was the first person to actually design a telescope to be used to look at the sky and our vast universe. Number 2. Surprisingly, Callisto has 99% of the diameter of Mercury but only one-third of its mass. At a diameter of 4,821 kilometers, Callisto is only 58 kilometers less than the planet Mercury, but its mass is only around a third of Mercury's mass. Number 3. Do you think Callisto is a planet? Well, many people do. Since Callisto is larger than the dwarf planet Pluto and a similar size to Mercury you might think it could be considered a planet. However, it orbits the planet Jupiter and not the Sun, which is the reason why it is not a planet. Number 4. The surface of Callisto is the most heavily cratered and also one of the oldest landscapes in our solar system. Scientists believe it is a dead world with no signs of geologic activity like plate tectonics or volcanism on its surface. There are more craters on Callisto than any other object in the solar system. Number 5. Similar to Earth and its moon, Callisto is tidally locked to Jupiter. This means that the same face of Callisto is always pointing towards Jupiter and Jupiter would appear to be still when viewed in Callisto's sky. Number 6. The largest crater on Callisto is nearly 4,000 kilometers across. Yes, you heard it right. 4,000 kilometers. It is named Valhalla, the Norse god Odin's hall where warriors are taken after death. Number 7. Did you know, Callisto is thought to have oxygen and also a thin atmosphere? The atmosphere of Callisto is very tenuous, and is composed mostly of carbon dioxide and probably molecular oxygen as well. Number 8. Callisto may be able to harbor life. Although it is not considered to be geologically active, the likely presence of an ocean beneath the surface of Callisto leaves open the possibility that it could actually support human life. Also, it has low levels of radiation and has long been considered the most suitable place for a human base for future exploration of the Jovian system. Number 9. One day on Callisto is 17 days on Earth, while a year there equals 12 years on our planet. It is about 1.8 times farther from Jupiter than Ganymede, 2.8 times farther than Europa and 4.5 times farther than Io, which is Jupiter's closest large moon. Number 10. In the past, some scientists thought of Callisto as a boring ugly duckling moon and a hunk of rock and ice. That's because the largely crater-covered moon didn't seem to have much going on. It had no active volcanoes or shifting tectonic plates. However, data from NASA's Galileo spacecraft in the 1990s revealed Callisto may have a secret, a salty ocean beneath its surface. Therefore, the once seemingly dead moon got itself added to the list of worlds that could possibly harbor life. That was all about Callisto for you. Do like, share, comment, and subscribe to our channel, Explified, 